So I just unpacked my Dragon Ball Z collection. Um, I've just had them stored in a box for so long and uh, I decided to put them up in my binder and I decided, you know what, I'm going to try to keep my collection the way in proper order, personalities, commons, uncommons, rare, secret rares. Uh, but I do have a whole Vegeta section considering that's where my collection started. Uh, I am missing a few on this this page and this page. Those three are actually Majin Buu uh, from the Buu Saga, uh, Bobbity Saga actually, or Majin Vegeta from the Bobbity Saga. And they're actually still in the mail, so when I get those I'll toss those in these pages. But we've got like Trunk Saga Vegeta, and then we've got, you know, the Android Saga, Cell Saga, even Vegeta Ascendant. I don't have the super cool ultra rare foil. It's not the best condition, but I mean, I played with these as well. So I'm going to have the Majin Vegeta 3. I've even got GT cards, which is kind of crazy. Like the Bobby Sagi Saga, Bobby Vegeta. I'm not sure which one from GT this was, but this is Vegeta the Saiyan. And then I went back and started putting all of my Vegeta, like if they have a picture of Vegeta or his actual card down here. So we've got Saiyan Saga cards, even Vegeta scans the city couple foils and then we're back into starting here we're back into the trunks saga I don't have any Frieza saga stuff but I've only got two actually other Vegeta cards and they're actually this one's a preview it's a preview for Super Saiyan effect Android Saga kept them in order all of these awesome Vegeta cards uh, one foil. This one's actually not Vegeta, but this is him holding Vegeta, so I put it in my collection. Yeah, you have to. Let's see what else we got. Saiyan Heads Up, still in Android Saga. And then we finally get into the Cell Saga. Vegeta fighting Cell here. Vegeta actually fighting Trunks. And we're making it into World Games Saga here. And then the Bobbity Saga preview cards face off with Majin Vegeta, my favorite character. And then we go into GT. We've still got some red close calls. This is Bobby Vegeta fighting Super Saiyan 4 Goku. One of Bobby Vegeta's cards. Goku, the, the fight's still going on. And now we're getting into Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. And this old school like Saiyan Saga looking card. It's really cool that they put that in the GT set. Yeah, a couple of these. And that's my Vegeta section. And then now I've just got regular collection cards. Starting with personalities and foils. And going in order. So my Saiyan Saga collection. All the way across. Still got two Piccolos. Both foil actually. I think they're starter deck maybe. Uh, two preview cards for Trunks Saga. Trunks Power Strike and Concentration Drill. And then going all the way through. I do have multiples of some cards. I just kind of kept them in. If I've got multiples. Here we go. We got some foils. Still within my Trunk Saga. Goku's battle ready. And we finally made it over starting here into Android Saga. And most of these cards are actually rare. It's like rare, 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 rare. So most of my regular... Android Saga cards actually just turned out to be rares. I'm not sure how that happened, but I'm not going to complain. And now back into Cell Saga, we're starting with Piccolo 1, 2, and 3. And then we get into just the basic order of cards. We've got all of these. And then we start with the World Game Saga. So Battle Simulator Pycon, pretty cool. Uh, Mariko, and then a Torby Unleashed. Super really cool foil looking card. And then we're still in the World Game Saga. Still fighting it out. Bunch of Goku everywhere. Shocker. And then I get into my Supreme Kai Power Hole. This is preview for uh, Bobbity Saga as well. And this is just an IRI random, randomly distributed promo. I know it's like a $5 promo, so I just held on to it. And then we go into... Uh, the GT series, I've still got my Goku Super Saiyan 3 and a bunch of the GT cards that I've kept and this was Bobby Saga this was Super Android Saga or something like that and I've got 
a really cool foil uh, Super Android 17, fresh from packing the sleeve. I found this actually in like a, a top loader in my collection. It's like the only thing that was in a top loader, which I thought was cool. A Goku Hero Fighter Super Saiyan 4 is cool. A foil Goten, which was in the uh, top loader on the back side of this, which I don't know why, but I thought it was really nice. Uh, Android 18, Piccolo, and then now we're just getting into the regular cards. I got a foil blue agile down here. We're still in this this show. I'm not sure if this is the the Super Android or not. I have this really strange like see-through Scouter physical attack table card. I thought it was a little strange, but that's kind of cool. And then now we're into the Shenron saga, I believe, or Shadow Dragon, Shadow Dragon, yeah, and. Goku the SS4 Battler. I think I only bought like seven or eight packs of this whole thing and this was like the first thing I got and it was definitely my favorite card. And I've got the, the see-through trunks that you can toss over top of this one. I've got one, two, and three all the way through. I've got Kai, Hei Shenron, and then I've got some promos actually. These were promos for this set. Soul Recharge and then Electrical Leg catch. Some of these beautiful cards. I haven't seen these in so long. Now we're in the purple fusion. That's really cool. I could have technically put that in my my Vegeta collection, but I I couldn't stretch it that far. And we're still looking through this black Shenron. Did I really like this? I forgot how much I um I actually bought of the GT series and then the villain subset I believe it is yeah Captain Ginyu the big wig <laughs> it's really funny but this was the villain villain invasion subset but it's a level four Captain Ginyu and this was I believe yeah movie collection and then vengeance so my movie collection um, I really only ended up with the Garlic Jr. personality, and then the Namekian surprise attack rare, and then for Vengeance I got all the way through, and I got really lucky, I got both Trunks and Brawly, I would like a, all of the Brawly, would be super cool because I love, I love Broly, and then my rare is again another Namekian pep talk, I mean I definitely wanted to put that one in my Vegeta collection, but I thought I'd keep all of the Vengeance cards together instead of trying to mess everything up keep all the score cards together I should say but yeah that's my uh, Dragon Ball Z collection I thought that was kind of kind of wild I spent so long trying to put it together but yeah I thought I had more Vegeta personality cards more than just you know 9 or 9 10 11 12 more than 12 but I was wrong I only had 12 so collection was not as awesome as I thought but if you enjoyed it Give me a thumbs up if you want to take a look at anything else. Leave it in the comments below. I'll definitely check it out. Thanks. Bye.